When I discuss test flakiness with people, very often I hear the argument that Playwright is just too fast. But let me tell you that I actually don't buy this argument. Let's look at an example. I have a quick demo site here that includes a page with a link that is called Navigate and it goes to a different page. And on this page here, we have a button that is called Click Me. And when I click it, I get this nice message. Let's look at the Playwright test for this scenario. The Playwright test navigates to localhost, then it clicks the Navigate link, then it clicks the Click Me button. And then we expect that there's a heading with the name or with the content nice. And that's pretty much it. But there's a problem with this test case. When we go to the terminal and we run this test case 15 times, we will discover that sometimes it works and sometimes it doesn't. This test case is flaky. So what's the problem? When we inspect the trace file, we will see that the navigate worked fine. We navigated to a different page. We clicked the button, but then the heading just wasn't showing up. And this is a very common problem. And you might now say, okay, Playwright was just too fast, wasn't it? Or did the test just show us a problem in our application? When Playwright or really any browser loads an HTML page, it tries to put something on the screen as quickly as possible. And while we then already can access all the content, there are usually many more resources still in flight. And for our simple button example, it's important that also script.js will be loaded because otherwise the button won't do anything. So my simple demo site and really the majority of the web really needs all the JavaScript to be loaded to offer the functionality of this site or app. And the problem is that very often we all ship UI that looks like it's working, but actually it is not until all the JavaScript is loaded. And this is, in my experience, very often the playwright is too fast case. But in reality, this also means that your app and my app are broken until all the JavaScript is loaded. And you might now say, yeah, but my app is very fast and it loads in 100 milliseconds. But is it really? This argument is pretty much the it works on my machine argument. Because sure, here on my MacBook, on a fast connection, everything runs super smoothly. But it could also be that your customers and users are on slow connections and you just will never know how long it will take until everything is loaded. But very often it's just us shipping UI that looks functional and is not. And at the end of the day, it's on you to decide how much of a problem that is. But if Playwright is too fast, usually some of your users will be too fast too. So what can you do about it then? So first of all, you could fix this broken app state or it's called poorly hydrated front ends and maybe disable UI elements that don't do anything, hide them, or maybe bet on progressive enhancement. Playwright is pretty good at clicking on elements that are active. And if changing the front end isn't an option, I will link some videos to help you work around these issues in your Playwright test cases.